Shimon Marciniak. In fact, it's more to do with a change for Italy. Zaza, who we presume might be one of the penalty kick takers, and Keeling, he won't be. It's going all the way between Germany and Italy. It's restricted Italy to very few chances, not that many. The goalkeeper is giant. OK, Insigne first, the substitute on, the smallest man on the pitch. And scores very coolly indeed. Magnificent penalty. I suppose it's always better taking the first and the last. Tony Crowe. And Crowe scores. Oh, that was quality personified, it really was. Buffon went the right way. But there was enough pace, enough direction. And the man who came on in the dying seconds of extra time, Simone Zaza, next up for Italy. Quite a deliberation and wide. And by some distance too. Well, that's the strangest run-up I've ever seen, I think. He's more like a ballet dancer here. Can do that. He's leaning backwards. Next up for Germany, Thomas Muller. Oh, will he finally get it? his name on the score sheet, even though it's a penalty in the shootout? And saved by Buffon. Well, that was the laziest penalty I think I've ever seen, really. The run up was not convincing. Look at this. He's looking at the goalkeeper and he's put it... Next up for Italy. Andrea Bassali. No problem for Bassali. 2-1 Italy. Mesut Ozil trying to restore parity in the penalty shootout. Some people can barely watch. Ozil then. No, off the post. Huge advantage now for Italy. Well, it looked a perfect penalty, didn't it? Sent Buffon the wrong way, but didn't hit the target. And Buffon going to his right. Graziano Pella can score here. Germany are on the brink of losing again in a major tournament to Italy. seen here that was dreadful that was absolutely shocking Neuer's not had a save to make yet one's gone in the stand and look at this get his team back in it it's Draxler no mistake 2-2 oh. that's got quality written all over it that's how you take a penalty with desire look he meant that look at that. and now the man who scored in normal time, Leonardo Bonucci. Ah, this is a quandary for Neuer. Does he go the same way as the penalty went? Oh, he saved it! Magnificent stop from Neuer! And a, less than a minute ago, Germany looked like they might be heading out. The years of anguish for Germany against Italy in major tournaments, losing in a World Cup semi-final, a World Cup final, a World Cup semi-final again. And four years ago, losing to Italy in the semi-final of the European Championship. This for victory! No! Schweinsteiger, high into the Italian fans! Remarkable! Seeing some of the worst penalties you've ever seen in a penalty shootout. That's the pressure, even at this level, with these great players. That's what it puts on you. But again, I said what I said. Ten penalties taken, five each. Six of them have been missed. Now, Giaccarini. Scores! Pressure back on Germany, and Max Hummels up next. Well... It's calmness personified, it really is. Pommels has to score. Against Buffon. Oh, and he nearly got there. Got a hand, but couldn't keep it out. Well, Hummels, if 
the get through con play in the semi final, but he's kept his team in it. Marco Parolo, he scores exactly what I've been saying. If in doubt, smash it down the middle. Good thinking. Don't try and be too clever. Look at this. Bang, he knows Neuer's going to go one way. 21-year-old Joshua Kimmich of Bayern Munich. And he scores. She just got it past the despairing right hand of Gigi Buffon. Again, right in the bottom corner. Goes the right way. Mattia De Cilio next for Italy. You can imagine what's going through his mind right now. To hit the back of the net. Well, that in the underside of the board, isn't it? Well, he can't play either in the semi. Jerome Boateng. Oh. Otherwise, the world champions are out. And he does score. On we go. Oh, the penalties are getting better, aren't they? They were almost comical in the first five, the five main penalty takers. Since then, Matteo Damian. And Neuer saves! Advantage, Germany again. Well, just as I said, when the penalties were getting better, we get another poor one. Jonas Hector of Cologne with the chance to put Germany into the semi-final. And he scores! Just got it beyond Gigi Buffon. And what is it about this Germany team in penalty shootouts? They were on the back foot taking the penalty second. So many times they had to keep their nerve going.